Good morning, everybody. It's Jolene Fisher here with our Tuesday core cardio workout. You're going to need a physio ball today, maybe a mat if you need some protection for your back as you're on your back doing some of the exercise we're going to be doing. All right, but besides that, you're going to start your watch. If you guys have a high intensity mode on your watch, go ahead and set that. We're going to be starting our exercise with four workouts. We got bicycles for 30 seconds, so we're starting in that core. And then we're going to go up for 45 seconds. We've got lateral. Shuffle, shuffle with a jump. Shuffle, shuffle, jump for 45. Then after that, we go right into our 30 second core with physio ball crunch. So we're gonna be on those shoulder blades, bringing our arms straight up to the ceiling. And then we're gonna go into a jumping jack after that. So that's the first four exercises. Bicycle crunch, shuffle, shuffle, shoot, physio ball crunch, and jumping jacks. All right, that's a total of about five minutes in each round. And then we're gonna do a total of three separate rounds, or two, two more separate rounds. So three total rounds, five minutes each. And you guys are gonna get about a minute and a half rest in between each round. Or you'll wanna get some water, kinda of cool that heart rate down, that kind of thing. All right, we got three minutes in our warm up to go. So let's go ahead and warm it up and then we'll get right into bicycles. All right, let's go with a high knee skip. All right, let's go into a jog. Let's do our one, two, three jog and scoop. One, two, three, heel down, toe up, scoop it out. One, two, three, switch. One more. All right, let's go some hamstring curls. Okay, let's take it on the move with grapevine. All right, bring it back to center. Deep sumo squat and reach side to side. Stretch it out. Sweep those arms down to the ground. Straighten out the legs. Stretch out the back. Come on. All right, we're gonna get started in that bicycle crunch. We're gonna get down to the floor. 30 seconds in bicycle crunch. So opposite elbow to opposite knee. The hands behind the neck or the behind the head. And let's go. And time, let's get up for shuffle, shuffle, shoot.
Go grab your ball. Get down for a physio ball crunch. Shoulders on that ball, lifting straight up, hands to the ceiling. Getting up for jumping jacks. Get down to the floor, bicycle crunch. Get up, shuffle, shuffle, shoot. Grab that ball, get down on the ball, crunches, and go. Jumping jacks. You're almost done. And time. All right, good job everybody. You got a little minute and a half break right now. We're gonna change up into a new routine. You don't need your ball anymore. Let's go ahead and get rid of that. We're gonna do bear crawls as our first core exercise. So we're on our hands and feet, knees are two inches off the ground, and we're doing a bear crawl forward and back for 30 seconds. And then we're gonna do knee repeat, which is a pulling of the knee up through the hands. We'll do half of our time on one leg and half our time on the other. Then we're going to be on our belly doing supermans. All fours come up for that. And then we're going to get up for cross hops. Both feet together, forward, back, side to side.
Okay, let's get down onto all fours. We're going in three, two, one, bear crawl. I don't care how fast you go. We just want to keep those knees a couple inches off the ground. So keep that booty low. All right, stand up. Knee repeaters. Pull that belly button into the spine. Make this core as well. And switch. Down on our belly, let's go. All arms and legs coming up. All right, get up, cross ups, forward, back, side to side, knees or feet together. Notice which side you start jumping toward first. We're gonna switch it up here in a little bit. All right, switch. Back to bear curls. Let's go. Knee repeater. Switch sides. All right, get on your belly. Superman's. Get up, cross ups. Switch sides.
for that time. Whew. Okay, guys, take a break. Minute and a half. Get some water. Okay, our third and final round. We're gonna start with bird dogs on all fours again. Opposite arm, opposite leg comes out, back in. We'll alternate. Just try and keep that belly button pulled up into the spine. After that, we're gonna get up for butt kickers. Bringing that heel to the butt. And then we're gonna be in a mountain climber. Slow twist. So bringing that right knee to the left elbow. After that, we're gonna get up for toe taps to finish out the round. Let's go ahead and get down onto all fours. Alternating arm, alternating leg. Three, two, and go. Try and keep that leg, arm parallel with your back. Pull that belly button into the spine. Flatten out the tummy. All right, get up for butt kickers. Heel to the butt. It's really intentional. Knees stay down. Get down into your high plank. Slow mountain climbers, opposite knee to opposite elbow, cross the body. Try and keep your butt somewhat low. You're not like sticking that butt way up in the air. Okay, get up, toe taps. All right, get down for bird dogs. Go.
All right, slow mountain climber twist. You wanna make sure that your elbows and wrists and shoulders are in alignment. So you're not having your hands in front of you. So shift your weight forward just a little. All right, toe taps, and then we're done. All right, time. Nice work, everybody. Time to cool it down. We're gonna do a breath work cool down. First, get some water if you need it. We're gonna take our hands straight up overhead, deep breath in. Exhale. Exhale, bending over at the waist, bring in the hands to the toes if you can, deep breath in, exhale, inhale and exhale on the exhalation, melt. Side to side. Bring that left knee down to the ground. Leg is straight, bring that right knee that's bent over top of that straight left leg. Bring the right arm straight out to the side. We'll deep breaths here. Melt into the stretch. Wind. 
します。Knees into the chest, rock side to side a little bit. Come on up, stay seated, cross the legs. We're going to take that chin forward and back. Take our right ear to our right shoulder. Take that right hand to assist that stretch. Your left hand can go behind your back if you want to increase the distance on that left side. Stretching out the left trap. Okay, keeping that left hand behind you. Take your chin. Point it toward your right breast and bring that chin down to the right nipple. Take your hand behind your head. So we're at a cross diagonal, getting that left levator scapula muscle. The traps and the levator scapula get really tight throughout the day. So this will help relieve some tension headaches. All right, bring that head up to neutral. Let's switch sides, right arm behind. This time bringing left ear to left shoulder. Assist that stretch. behind and pull. Okay, let that go. Now we're going to floss the spine by doing some cat cows. This is a great daily movement to do if you have back pain. All right, we're gonna bring that mid back up and just, so we're through the thoracic spine and the mid back while we chuck the chin. We're gonna come into cow where we go into sway back, the chin out. And when we do the inhalation phase, we're gonna be going into cat. Exhalation phase is into cow. Okay, so we'll start in cow with the chin out. Let's deep breathe in, five second breath in. Here we go. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. bringing those knees out, using your elbows to spread your knees, using your body weight to sit down on the heels and getting that stretch in the calf. All right, we're gonna come to a standing position. Keep your heels together, toes pointed outward. Straighten the legs. Keep the hands down on the floor. Come on up. Roll the 
chambre. All right, guys, that's it for today. I'll see you guys here tomorrow for our lower body day. So we'll be working the legs. And then Thursday is upper body day. So join me all week as we get these exercises in, get that whole body. If you joined me yesterday for our hit four by four, you might be pretty sore today. So that breathing and stretching felt really nice. All right, guys, have a great Tuesday. Bye, everybody.